Did you know that the hinge on your glasses is arguably the most important component? For example, on the Iva by Haylander, which to be fair is designed to be an affordable brand, we have a single barrel hinge. We have one pin on one side, two pins on the other, and they go together like so. That means it's very easy to come loose or break. So if you're looking for a more premium pair of glasses, for example, the Stubbs by Walter and Herbert, look for five barrel hinge. So much more durable. And one type of hinge that I generally recommend to avoid is the typical spring hinge like you see in the Scoochie pair. It's designed to be more stylish than practical. The spring hinge means that this will fit to a wide variety of different face shapes. There really is no need for a spring hinge, it's just one more thing that's going to eventually fail and render your glasses useless. Then we have the weird and wonderful hinges, such as the rotating hinge, which is unique to McLaren frames, or the springe frames from Industrial in Paris literally have an exposed spring on the hinge. Reykjavik eyes feature their own patented screwless hinge. And speaking of screwless hinges, one of my favourite examples is by Flair. Their coiled screwless hinge design is a masterpiece and an amazing example of German engineering.